New at 10, a new trash site has some Greenville County neighbors fired up. Greenville County approved this facility three years ago. It's close to downtown on Old Easley Highway. Uh, some neighbors say this is their last chance to take a stand. Fox County's Alexa Erbach takes us to the protest. We are here to spread the word about the community opposition to this plan and to ask our legislators to ensure that DHEC denies this request. That request? A waste transfer station at 621 Old Easley Highway for Greater Greenville Sanitation, a facility where collection trucks unload trash so it can be compacted before it heads to a landfill. I can see the benefit of a transfer station, but not two miles from downtown Greenville. Come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. David Davis has been fighting the proposed site for years. Its fate now sits with the Department of Health and Environmental Control, which is considering the permit. It's not needed. It's not, it's not necessary. It's not the right place. And it doesn't need to happen. It shouldn't happen. And our government should be protecting us against it happening. Neighbors like Katie Rabe are concerned about potential environmental hazards with the site being so close to the Saluda River. It's vital to our, our drinking. It's vital to um, It's important that we protect the land. I have children, I'm a teacher, and I want it to be preserved. Residents are using their voices to protest at the Saluda Outdoor Center, a popular location for fun activities like tubing and camping, a location that's also less than two miles from where the proposed waste transfer station would be built. No. I do not want this waste transfer station. I say no because there's a lot of uncertainty. I don't want this uh, dump here. Absolutely not. No. No, I do not. Absolutely not. That was the resounding response from people who came out. We thought DHEC was there protecting us. We need DHEC to look at our health and safety issues. Do we matter? Davis calls what Greater Greenville Sanitation did a bait and switch. In 2019, asked to come to our neighborhood watch meeting, showed the maintenance facility and office annex, nothing about a transfer station. And yet, that's what they got. When you start talking about a transfer station, then you're talking about elements that can go into the Saluda River, that can go into the soil, underground streams that may not have been identified, and can impact people's health. Greenville County Council Member Alan Mitchell says he plans to write his own letter to DHEC about the concerns he heard. If we can get the decision for Greater Greenville's permit to be delayed so that we can do some more studying, so that we can bring Greater Greenville to the table and listen to both sides, I think that would be a more appropriate thing to do. The message neighbors want to get across? Greenville County should be looking at this as an asset and not a dumping ground. Alexa Erbach, Fox Carolina.